All right, all right, all right. So today I'm back with another psychopathic idea. Now you're excited to hear that. Uh, duplicating NBA legends when they win a ring. You know what, though? We got a draft to get to. So basically, as I set up this draft, how this is going to work is that I selected about the 30 to 50 greatest players of all time, threw them in a current day roster. So you're about to see some players. They're all 19 years old, every single one. It's not every all time legends. It's not mixed. I, I handpicked the ones that we'd probably care about. And as you can see, them rolling across the board right now. And they're going to go to each individual team. They will never move teams unless they're traded there will be no free agency and if the player wins a ring they will be duplicated if one of these legends if multiple are on one team they will be duplicated and put into the draft class and then the goal is technically to take over the league as yourself if that makes any sense as we get into the second round and ray allen still getting drafted uh it, it's, it's a lot going on dr j went first round uh some of the last players of legends here like dennis rodman derrick rose george gervin i just it's like roughly like some of the top 75 players minus like you know i don't know like i'm sorry but i didn't put bob pettit in here Oh, yeah, I threw in Gilbert Arenas for fun. And now we're back to some more normal players. Hell, where, where's Victor at? He get picked yet? Oh, there you go. Bucks, uh, they get Victor. They might have. Do they have Victor and LeBron? Uh, no. The, oh, wow. The Knicks got the first pick. Wait, it, it was the Knicks, right? Yeah. Yeah, I, I did not set. Uh, you could see my settings at the beginning, probably. All right. We could simulate this thing. Screw it. Now, every player is 19, but of course, a player like Victor is still very valuable because he has a 99 potential. Draft classes are going to just be normal. 2024 draft class. But like I said, so, okay, so let's take a, a gander at these teams you got kd and jason kidd uh this is the young version of kd i put in the young ver that was another thing i gotta mention i have prime westbrook in, in here instead of regular westbrook prime derrick rose instead of regular De derrick rose and i do have prime lebron prime kd prime curry even i tried not to leave any but uh Kawhi as well there's some other guys i could have done but i tried to limit it to like those guys that are like top 30 to 40 all time or well at least in terms of 2k overall kd jason kidd julius randall josh giddy and robert williams low-key this would have been a decent one for me to draft manually but i you know th those take a lot of time actually i'd be drafting those for like four or five hours and i'm good today i'm all right oh wow Giannis, vince carter tyrese and victor so victor went pick one around four so that means that Giannis, i guess he fell wait so either yeah oh, oh well Giannis and vince must have been pick 30 and then pick one in the second round that's what it was and then they somehow got victor and tyrese with the next two of those yeah they they finessed pretty crazy and Giannis is back on the bucks again dirk and russell westbrook with bradley beal and wiggins on the bull Bulls, Dwayne Wade, Isaiah Thomas, Jaron Jackson, and Valanciunas. A lot of defense on this team. Larry Bird, Donovan Mitchell, DeMar DeRozan. Well, that's another. I will, like I said, I wasn't adding just every single prime player. It was just like the guys that were like elite, you know, when I was going through trying to get the elite players in. Sorry, well, you know, DeRozan, you got elite footwork. I, I rock with you. Steph Curry, Carmelo Anthony, Paolo, Desmond Bain, and Jordan Clarkson. A lot of buckets on this team. The best center they drafted was Chet, actually. So Chet will be their starter at least year one. Carl uh, Malone, Joel Embiid. Jalen Brunson, Laurie Markin, and Devin Vassell. I would imagine these were they had a later pick because that's kind of an insane top two. Elgin Baylor, James Harden, Jamal Murray, Brooke Lopez, and D'Angelo Russell, Chris Paul, Rick Barry, Sabonis, DeJounte Murray, and Buddy Heald on Miami. This is like the team that that isn't as flashy, but then is randomly gonna win seven rings. And this is a thing, right? So obviously, like let's say this team wins a ring, right? It's not like they get Chris Paul duplicated on their team. He's going to the draft class. So he might go to the team, you know what I'm saying, that they end up playing the next year. That's the point, is that I want to see players take over the league. Uh, Tim Duncan, Penny Hardaway, Paul George leading the Hornets, Scottie Pippen and Luka Doncic. That's kind of a perfect little combo there because, you know, for more defense and Clay Thompson as well on Utah. Stockton and Ewing with Towns at the four and Kuzma on the Kings. LeBron, Anthony Davis, Gil Gilbert Arenas, Derek White. And okay, so it drops off after the third, but that's a crazy big three and still a overall really solid starting five. Jerry West, Ray Allen, Zach Levine and Rudy Gobert on the Lakers. I don't know why they drafted Gobert and Capella. Dr. J, Bill Walton, Drew Holiday, Porzingis, and Mitchell Robinson on the Magic. I like this team a little bit. Shaq and Dennis Rodman with Trey Young, Simons, and Tobias Harris on the Mavericks. You know, going to be lacking shooting at the four and five. Bill Russell, George Gervin, Edwards, Garland, and Jabari Smith on the Nets. They definitely went for the younger pick there because they it falls off. Like, I think this is the first team I've seen without 580. Kareem, Damian Lillard, Kyrie, RJ Barrett, and Dinwiddie. I don't know how this got through. Dame and Kyrie with Kareem man in the middle is is pretty wild. Jokic, Gary Payton, Mikael Bridges, and De and DeAndre Hunter and Horford. They brought de literally every defensive player to surround Jokic as well as shooting. Walt Frazier, Dominique Wilkins, uh, Tyrese Maxey, Draymond Green, and Jordan Poole. Kevin Garnett, Derrick Rose, Bam Adebayo, Malcolm Brogdon, OG. I like this team. This is some more defense as well. David Robinson, Tracy McGrady, De'Aaron Fox, Middleton, and Smart. And by the way, these teams, you know, I'm not just wasting your time and they're going to go 
going to free agency in two seconds. Now, these teams are going to be together this whole time. Unless they might. I have trades on, but like, you know, Trey Lyles would maybe get traded. Jakob Pertl. I don't know. If they want to make a trade, go ahead. But there's also no financial restrictions on trade. So they can, you know what I'm saying? It, that doesn't matter. Technically, the stars could get traded as well. But most of them, I would assume, would be untouchable. This is another nice team. And then Michael Jordan, Dwight Howard, Zion, CJ McCollum, and Bog, uh, Bojan. They got their shooters, their shot creators, and they got absolute paint dominance. Uh, can't really space the floor for Michael. So he's going to go that mid-range a lot, which I don't think he's complaining too much. Even their backup is Ben Simmons. Magic Johnson and James Worthy back again together with Pascal, Tyler Hero, and Walker Kessler. That's solid. Hakeem, Jason Tatum, and Shea. Who allowed this? Claxton and Jalen Williams joined them. And they got Shade and Sharp, too. I already know his potentials through the roof. Kobe, Grant Hill. You know, I saw him on the roster, and I was like, screw it, I'm going to throw him in. He had, like, a lot of really big-time hype in the 90s. And I was just watching an interview with him, so that made me want to throw him in. I, look, it's my channel. Who the hell's going to stop me? Ja Morant, DeAndre Aiden, and Malik Monk on the Thunder. That's solid. Pretty, Very solid. Nice big three they got going on with uh, Grant Hill, Ja, and Kobe. Clyde Drexler and Allen Iverson with Aaron Gordon, Scotty Barnes, and Yusuf Nurkic. Solid little one-two punch. Oscar Robertson and Devin Booker with Evan Mobley, Michael Porter Jr., and Reeves. This might be a, a trouble, troublesome team for the rest of the league because Mobley gets pretty good when, when you sim. I mean, this is the thing. All these players are going to improve technically because they're all 19, but you know, he's got better potential than most. Moses Malone, Steve Nash, nice pick and roll duo. And then you got Ingram, Jalen Green, and Jaden McDaniels. And last but not, well, yeah, probably not least, you got Will, Jimmy Butler, Jalen Brown, LaMelo Ball, and Sengun. I've I, I seen some elite teams and uh shoot this would be a good idea even without the little stipulation i got going on but hey that's that's the, that's the video you know you look here like when i take control of a team they fire their gm by default you see like right here like if i was to t lose control of all these teams would they hire a gm today random thought here's the all-star teams kareem hakeem jason kidd scotty and westbrook with clyde oscar julie serving lebron and kg on the starters of the other team bill walton sneaks in here um it is mostly legends it's mostly mostly the guys that I added, if not all. I mean, I guess, yeah, that would make sense. That would make sense because it's not like every player is a 99 or something. Was Jokic there? Because I didn't add Jokic, obviously. Jokic is in his prime. Nah, I don't see Nikola or, or Embiid, I don't believe. As of today, Bill Walton, who's basically, and I was literally about to say, he basically does become Jokic in these sims. Oh, they might've just said, screw it, you're white, and you could have Jokic's tendencies. Like, it, there, someone could fact check this, but they might've just thrown him Jokic's tendencies. But that being said, he was a much better defender than Jokic. And yeah, you could see as he's ever three blocks if anything that was mostly his calling back in the olden days him and dr j are top two in the uh, mvp race and they are number one in the conference they are they are number one in the eastern conference 40 and 13 from bill walton and dr j julius serving most valuable player victor rookie of the year fred van vliet six man bill russell dpoy trey young most improved dirk clutch player of the year and wes unso coach of the year. that just gave me nom flashbacks of when uh when dirk hit that shot against mellow i was watching that game hit the shot against mellow Hello. this man Dirk like that's when I knew the year was over when he, sh he shot this shot and it bounced up to the solar assist outside or touched the sun and then came back down and went in off the back rim like crackhead why, why did you do this to my young younger self Wes Unseld coach of the year did I say that already I don't know okay uh, KG Dr. J Russell Westbrook Rick Barry and Alger Baylor first team here's the second team here's the third did I see Trey Young on it now yeah. and you're the third team defensive players whoop de doo and your rookies same all rookies brandon miller the race walker this dude vasilege mitchich oh i think this dude i think he's on the thunder if i'm not wrong maybe i'm wrong yeah he was picked like a a, a century ago as you can see 2014 but hey he's around playoffs honestly do i want to over evaluate and see who was trash or whatever all these teams are good so uh yeah here's the worst team though uh the yeah the celtics and the pacers actually tied at 27 wins wow that Jokic team you know what this proves that defense in 2k is not good because he has a great defense of team and it does not matter to be fair though he drafted notoriously like bad 2k players i don't know if okay mikhail is good this year gary payton also solid well you know i guess not solid enough they also have terry rozier who scores a lot so yeah screw it you guys just suck i guess oh wow they have vanderbilt too yeah that's they, they low-key don't have enough offense and then the celtics this doesn't surprise me 
yeah, this is this makes sense. You got Larry Bird, whatever. But 60 wins is actually the Wizards. That's Jimmy Butler, Wilt, Lamelo. I, I, hey, what I say about this team? It's a nice team. The last team, definitely not least. Remember that. And the Magic, Delon Wright starting next to Drew with Dr. J, Porzingis, and Bill Walton, Mitchell Robinson off the bench, and that led them to number one. Shout out to Delon Wright, the real MVP. And then the Blazers at 53 wins. They got D Book, Oscar, Michael Porter Jr., Mobley, and Onyeko Kongu. I said they were gonna be a problem down the line, not immediately but okay that works for me they got a nice little bench too austin reeves off the bench kongwu and mobley is elite defense and uh screw it yeah i'm not i'm not trying to watch every round i'm trying to see the progression of this league you know go watch some finals games though something like that uh so far it has went awry in the west you got hold on real quick all right washington and the magic first of all wilt is at the four right now with sangoon at center i think you know you'd maybe want to reverse that i don't know but you got the one versus two seed the teams i just went over so if this if these teams were to win um bill walton and dr j would be duplicated for the magic and honestly i'd probably make an exception and duplicate jimmy with will and that's the top two maybe i don't know you know it's it's my video i do i'll probably do two per team something like that well no because some teams have three damn dude i don't know yeah yeah i'll probably just do the best players any player over 90 or something like that that, that sounds that sounds good that sounds good and then you got scotty and luca in the west which these are like the four versus five feet seat or something like that up against jerry ray allen kevin love at the four all right this is the team that drafted rudy and clint and they're doing pretty well for themselves scotty might have zach levine in the torture chamber very soon though wizards just swept to go to the finals and oh it's going to be a game seven win scotty pippen and wilt chamberlain your conference mvps jimmy jalen and wilt with Lamelo against luca and scotty see what happens game one is wizards domination as you probably guessed game two oh the yep the jazz are gonna hold it on hold on to it wilt had 41 in the loss wizards will take another win screw we're going to the whatever the elimination games are Wizards up three to two and they will win the finals so Jalen brown will chamberlain and jimmy butler are your first three champions and yeah i do say Jalen brown uh will finals mvp i just realized it just says finals mvp it's not no like gatorade finals it like I, it, I i guess it's not any i never thought about that i mean yeah that makes sense though it's like an esteem wait isn't it the bill russell finals mvp shoot i don't know i mean it is wilt taking it so maybe bill said you <laughs> that's that's probably kind of funny though wilt wins finals mvp bill like hell no so to follow my rule of any Anybody over 90 in this draft class, I'm gonna be taking Wilt Chamberlain, Jimmy Butler, and Jalen Brown. Duplication glitch complete. Wilt, Jimmy, and Jalen in the 2024 draft class. And this is their current selves, by the way, just to fully make that clear. So once we're like at like, you know, 24 year old players, 25, it will be 24, 25 year old players gonna add to the draft class as well. But I didn't even really think about it like that, but a win this early is actually a perk because your player is gonna be, you know what I'm saying, you got more chance to take over the league or whatever. And I'll probably find a way to do some sort of tally or maybe. Maybe I'll just mentally think, oh yeah, this player cooked. Like if Wilt wins every year, I wonder who, you know what I'm saying, is going to be the leader. I don't know why it's saying that the Hornets re-signed Tim Duncan. Free agency is not on, right? I'm just making sure. Yeah, negotiated contracts off. All this stuff is off. Am I wrong? I, I don't I don't know. The first overall pick in the draft, or who is going to get it? Let's see, Pacers, Celtics, and Kings up there, and it's going to go to the Heat. The Heat and Bucks. So the Heat jumped up from 12 to 1, and the Bucks jump up from 10 to, to, to 2. And the other remaining teams just fell down a little bit in the lottery. Okay. Okay, yeah, I was just making sure. I believe the free agents are still free agents. Let me see. Or, or my bad that the players are all still signed. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's any free agents or nothing. So that's good. NBA draft. I would assume this would go how I'd expect it. Wilt. Yeah, Wilt number one. Jimmy Butler number two. And Jalen Brown number three to the Celtics at that. And then the other guys are going to get a rude awakening. They're not getting no 90s. But, you know, you get you get some good players. These guys are going to make impact in the league probably at some point. It depends on how good the league gets so fast. Hello, Bronny. Free agency shouldn't exist. That, that works. Hello, the Kevin Porter Jr. Uh, progression and everything is on so you know what i'm saying that'll all take into account and bada bada da bada da boom i bada da boom i bada da bing here's the all-star team this year do i care to read them out again no rick barry wins mvp this year and actually that means that the miami heat just had right then they just have the number one overall pick so here you go you're already seeing the impact wilt chamberlain rookie of the year on the heat now six man of the year sub bonus on the heat bill russell dpoi Jokic, most improved and clutch player ray allen makes sense greg Popovich coach of the year with the Spurs. Here's the first team, second team, third team, but really, hello, Trey Young. Out of the Heat, they both had 60 wins. Spurs had 60 wins with James Worthy, Magic Johnson, and Pascal Siakam, Walker Kessler, et cetera, et cetera. And then the Heat, Chris Paul, Rick Barry, Jante Murray, Mark.
Marvin Bagley and Wilt Chamberlain. The Bucks also, oh my, the Bucks got, so they have Jimmy with Vince Carter, Tyrese, Giannis, and Victor. They are going to be an absolute issue. And they, they won 50 games this year. So they're not, you know, at the lead or anything, but shoot, they might be soon. Also, just because I didn't do this last year, I forgot, nor did I care. Um, Points. Okay. So Trey Young must be leading the scrubs over there in Dallas. Ironically, Julius Irving, Rick Barry, and Clyde Drexler and Tatum led in points. Then you got rebounds, Kareem, assists, Steve Nash with 15 of those. Couple steals from Iverson, Kareem in the blocks department. Will and field goal percentage on the Wizards to be exact, not the other version of himself. Actually, the other version of himself is almost 10% lower in field goal percentage, which is kind of weird. And then three point Elgin Baylor, actually. He doesn't shoot too many though. All right, screw it. Playoffs so far, so whatever. And the Heat are going to lose to the Wizards. So Will played himself and lost to the other version of himself even though the heat were the number one seed and we're actually going to get orlando uh that is dr j bill walton the number one seed from last year actually and they have a men thompson at the two instead of whoever they had at the one they had they had the line right right that was what i was talking about and the heat still trudging on they uh, are the wizards i don't know why i thought the heat because i saw the color red they now have Lamelo also at a 90 so if they were to win you know what i'm saying they go another player san antonio and the lakers i think the reason why i want to duplicate all 90s as well is because the goal is that the player that gets the most duplications wins and if you're like a 90 plus you have a big impact on a team you know what i'm saying regardless and then also the players are going to get diverted to different teams we're going to see who's the most powerful of the individual players you know what i'm saying uh anyways james worthy magic against ray allen and jerry west okay both uh they, they're the number one and two seed and the lakers are actually up 3-0 and that's 4-0 and the the wizards came back and forced game seven but they end up losing to bill walton and the magic in seven they came back from down three one to force it but lost so you get some new candidates this year drew dr j and bill walton against jerry west ray allen rudy gobert and zach levine and it is going to be a three one series lead for the lakers and three two now you gotta i think you know game sixes are really the wave that's when things start to get interesting nice little sunny day with a game six screw it it's 92 91 we're gonna jump in with three minutes to go because i you know what i'm saying i'm trying to see good games i'm not trying to see game you know saying no non interesting game ones though you know i maybe i'm just maybe i'm just tired of all this oh that's the other thing too foul outs are on and oh okay well i saw mitchell robinson i was like is bill walton fouled out but no he is not he's right there porzingis though so they have porzingis at like the three right now and kayla martin's at the one against jerry west this is confusing i actually do think i'm gonna turn foul outs off after this so you know what though that's that's a skill though so just don't foul out screw you Dr. J, bucket on, while Kyle Lowry is guarding him. 2.47 to go. The Lakers will take a timeout. Love passing the ball to Levine. Levine goes left, back out to the right, hands it off. Jerry West with a contested three. That's off. Rebound by Thompson. Shoot, one of the Thompsons. Forgot which one that is. Over to Holiday, back out to Walton. Walton passes it down to Irving. Irving in the post. Dr. J. The fade away, and that is off. Rebound by Love. Love, oh, the screen by Gobert, and West misses the corner three. Thompson back out to Porzingis. Chris stops to Irving. Dr. J, step back, back over to Chris stops. He'll pump fake, pass it to Thompson. Thompson over to, who is that? Uh, I can't even see the name. Uh, oh, that's Drew. Drew for three. Bucket. Levine steps back for three. That is good. The Zach Levine step back, it's, it's so smooth. Look, look at this step back real quick. Bring the left, boom. Levine step. Look, hold on, one more time. Step nice one of my friends uses shout to ace if you watching one of my friends uses this in red and he'd be cooking with the zach levine step back it's like there's no no contest on it ever irving pump fakes irving floater that's off rebound by levine zach levine goes left around oh he's gonna pass it off to go bear to take the lead dr j pump fakes and layup is good to take the lead with 52 seconds ago timeout green on the right by go bear and levine goes right behind the back he'll fade away and that is off rebound by Walton. Bill runs it up the court himself. I mean, he is a facilitator. 32 seconds to go. Will they foul when it hits the time? Oh, never mind. They won't even have a chance. Drew for three. That is good. And that is a four point lead by the Magic. And they're going to force a game seven. It's looking like Levine passed down and the steal by Holiday. That's crazy. That's similar to what happened in that one game when they was playing actually the Celtics in real life. And he got that steal from half court. And that is off. Wait, I think I zoned. I was reading something on my phone and I zoned out as the Lakers failed twice actually now. Yeah, it's a 33 
23 from Jew, Drew and 31 from Dr. J. I could already smell the timestamps. Uh, and the Magic are going to win the championship. Drew Holiday saved them 20 and 8. Bill Walton finals MVP. And with that being said, I'm pretty sure Drew actually just cracked the 90s. So Dr. J, Bill Walton, and Drew Holiday will be in this year's draft class. Drew Holiday, very respectable guy. Those three 20 year olds went to the draft. Player retirements this year? Oh, yes. Players that got cut, I guess. They didn't make teams or whatever. Draft lottery. Nuggets, Jazz, Cavs, Clippers, and Celtics are top five. And the Pelicans will get it. The Pelicans had to have jumped up from somewhere obscure. Yep, from seven to one. And yeah. Now, there's actually a question on who they're going to draft. Number one, Dr. J goes number one. Look at that old body photo. Old, old, rusty photo. Uh, and Bill Walton will go number two to the Clippers. Celtics get Drew number three. They are just building their team. Seems that Jalen didn't help him too much in year one. Drew joins the team. So now they, they should have an insane squad, if I had to guess. They have Drew, Jalen, Donovan. Oh, this is a team that said that Loki wasn't that good, though, at first. But now, now they're looking pretty solid. Oh, they, well, they also have Cade. Yeah, no, they, they got a lot. They got a lot going on now. Here's the all-star teams, if you care. I just realized how all, they have so many all-star appearances. About to have, like, 40 by the time. I'll, I'll probably do this for, like, 10 years or something. Maybe 20, maybe 40. Will wins MVP with the Heat. Dr. J, rookie of the year. Lonzo Ball, six man. Scotty Pippen, DPOI. Will, most improved. Jokic, clutch player. Spolster, coach the year here's the first team second team the third team playoffs here's a look at your what's to call your league leaders boom Clyde Drexler led in scoring rebounds was Kareem assists with Steve Nash steals John Stockton blocks Shaq Bill Gold Bill Russell didn't check three screw the three I guess also as yeah we saw what's his name when the MVP will here's his team again and they are the best in the league this year 52 wins from the Nets as well looks like the league is getting a lot more even like a little bit scarily even oh yeah did I remove I I think i removed the playing game yeah i, I did I? Yeah, I guess i did consciously do that yeah screw the playing game whatever anyways on to the conference finals brooklyn versus detroit darius garland anthony edwards george gervin jabari smith jr and bill russell against bam kg brandon miller og and d rose and he got shea jason tatum and akeem against dwight zion and michael jordan and oh uh four two and four three the higher seeds win in both series is darius garland and akeem uh, mvps of the conference Shea versus Garland, Shaden versus Edwards, Tatum versus Gervin, and Akeem versus Bill Russell. So far, it is Nets dominance. Nets up 3-1 now. Now the Suns fighting back for some reason. I guess they have grit. The Suns are going to smoke the Nets. Actually, it was smoking them for most of the game until the fourth. Crazily enough. 3-3, game seven. Game seven in Brooklyn. 2.44 to go. The Nets are up by four. Shea goes left. Started by Edwards. Hands it off. Tatum pump fakes. Back to Shea. Shea over to Hayes. Is this Killian Hayes in an NBA Finals game seven? Is that what I'm witnessing? One minute? This is his one minute. That is because Shaden Sharp fouled out. Okay. Lajuan makes its way over to Tatum in the corner. Tatum will pull the three, and that is good to cut it to one. Big time shot by Tatum. Whoa, 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 wait, 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 hold on. Is this Jalen Williams? Jalen, Jalen, hold on. What What happened? Is that Bill Russell setting the screen? Yeah, no wonder. Bill Russell just set a screen. This is this is a 60s screen or something, dog. This man, Jalen Williams, was on the ground for a millennium. And who is that? that's not trying to get open jabari smith go to the three-point line get a get a shot what are we yo i have never oh, let me play this in real time right watch how long this screen look at how long he's on the ground he's still on the ground actively and he's just waiting there's no awareness waiting for the screen a bucket yep bucket anyways four point game again elijah one in the post elijah okay Russell with the foul. Elijah one at the line. The first one is good. And Garland will step back. Close shot. Mid-range. Kind of bordering on both. That's good. Shea goes left. Stops. Pass down to Hakeem. Hakeem the post against Bill. Hakeem the pump fake from the hook. And he'll pass it back out to Jalen Williams with the baseline. Pump fake. And that close shot will miss. And the rebound by Jabari Smith. Jabari hands it off to Garland. Garland goes left. Garland between the legs. Pump fake. Post. I don't even know what's going on. Somehow he got fouled. He's doing footwork and no footwork at the same time. Garland, both free throws are good. Screen on the left. Shea pass down to Olajuwon. Olajuwon in the post. Olajuwon layup is good. Hey, it's still a minute left. Maybe you have a chance. Akeem, look, Akeem wearing number eight. Usually wearing 34, right? Yeah, so you know, it, it looks pretty decent. I also like these Suns. Suns jerseys are very nice this year as Darius hits a shot. Yeah, the Suns jerseys are really nice now. And I saw something about jerseys being uninspired, I think. And it, it's true those jazz jerseys they look okay but like the concept of just the number we need to 
end minimalism and i rock with minimalism but we need to end it just for that it, not an nba jerseys dog and wow they get a moving screen yeah, the jazz jerseys do not have to be that minimal the suns ones though they do a good mixture it's like clean still Nice. Gervin to Garland. Garland back to Gervin. And, and, and well, I don't know why I'm still commentating this. This is over with. The, the Nessie NBA champions. Garland had 40. And he earned that, too. He earned that win. Garland finals MVP. So there's a lot of people getting duplicated in this game. Or wait, duplicated? I don't know. Whatever. Yeah, duplicated. That's exactly what I was looking for. Bill Russell, George Gervin, Darius Garland, and um, Anthony Edwards, who was actually on the lower end. It's funny because, you know, I actually was just watching. They have the ESPN rank just came out. Or at least the i think it was from 90 Shout out to my dog samson he made a, a he, i already know you're watching this this intricate my player league and i was copying his my player so i could play on his my league with my player i don't know with that being said i was looking at the nba rank stuff and they actually had anthony edwards at like 13 and he was over a lot of people like damian lillard he was over i think or 12 or something like that he was at and it was interesting because or well first of all i'm not saying that espn holds you know a right above law to decide everything for the world that i don't know if they're right or not but we'll see you know maybe i think it was more of a predictive ranking ranking than it was a res like respect retrospective ranking i'm pretty sure it was more of a predictive one than like a hindsight type of thing like oh yeah let's let's you know rank the past year but um so draft lottery once again it actually should have updated by now yeah bill russell garland's actually ranked one and then edwards and bill and peterson am i missing oh i was about to say yeah george gervin what the hell why is he ninth in this one who knows so those guys are gonna be the top four of the lottery a thousand percent likely Cavs, jazz celtics and kings are top four and it's gonna be the celtics kings Cavs, and raptors so the raptors sneak in there celtics number one they will get bill russell they have got a lot of picks boy oh, i gotta check out the celtics in a second garland goes two. george gervin goes three to the Cavs, and anthony edwards four to the raptors but no uh, you know we'll see if the other teams make some work some impact whatever but no let me see the celtics real quick because they got a lot of players and i checked them last year too but bird russell mitchell cunningham if anything the one thing they needed was a center the one position they needed to fill literally that's it i mean DeRose Rosen isn't really a four. Shoot, well, now you got the center of a lifetime, though, so it doesn't matter anyway. Oh, wow. The Wizards actually offered Trey Murphy. They need his services. I mean, I guess technically, yeah, you can. Damn. Yeah, I didn't really. Oh, wow. That's actually, yeah, it would be a good player for their team. He'd make the rotation for sure. That's funny. That's the only free. I want to actually see that. We're oh, my God. Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. Uh, oh. Oh, some other guys got signed too. Um, yeah, sure, why not? Here's the all-star teams in case anybody in this world cares. Eric Rose is there. Oh, Jokic made it, finally. Wilt gets another MVP. I'm not even... This is the other Wilt, isn't it? Bill Russell. Oh, yeah, right. Rookie of the year. Yeah, I forgot. Lonzo DPOI. That Bill Russell also won DPOI. At, at this point, I just got to refer to them as an entity. Like, you know? And what's crazy is this is, what, year four? And we're still waiting for one of the teams that reap the benefits of all of these things to win the ring. And as you can see, the Celtics are finally not in the lottery my god they're actually perusing through the playoffs right now four to two and uh four to one over the orlando magic i don't know why i just sped through that but i was just waiting for them to make it all the way here larry bird and clyde drexler that's kind of crazy that larry bird and uh for a second i had to question if larry bird was here the whole time because i i feel like i would have realized that he was on the celtics i don't know why my my thoughts never accumulated um how the hell are the timber you know what maybe maybe it makes sense but they're the one seed okay well they have they have lonzo too and dj wagner i, I it was just kind of crazy seeing you know i rock with kavon looney he's a rebounder and stuff but it's kind of crazy seeing him starting for a championship team in this league because with how stacked the league should be by now and it looks like the Celtics are gonna sweep so bill russell hey there you go your first ever double duplicate larry bird bill russell see now i gotta make a second bill russell though because he's different this year you know he's a new man wait hold on Jalen's also a multi-duplicate and drew i forgot they had the whole every team it's safe to say that this is gonna be a lot one two three four five six seven there is seven players one two three four five six seven i don't know why i was just double checking to make sure because it was a lot of players i had to take a lot of players now i won't lie well, so this is the first bird duplication and I do put more value into the players, you know, the legends, you know, but uh, plus Bill did come to this team and they went from top pick to get him to champions. So he honestly is the king of this sim right now, at, you know, at surface level. It might continue, which is interesting from the non-offensive non, non -offensive player, but he's bringing all the defense in the, in the league to the 
teams hawks jazz nuggets and raptors top four and go to the kings raptors bucks and hawks what did the kings jump up from also once again trades are on so teams can move can trade their pick i just haven't seen it happen kings move from seven to one and matter of fact i would be surprised if we saw like a trade during this draft specifically because i'm about to be here for a few picks kings number one pick donovan mitchell number two will be larry bird the raptors number three k to the bucks how has bill not been picked and there you go a trade the fourth overall pick for Lori market and end Devin Vassell and the Grizzlies will get DeMar DeRozan honestly I guess that's kind of fair and depends on what you wanted but yeah that, that's actually kind of fair another trade to announce the fifth overall pick for Steven Adams okay knowing that this is going to be Bill Russell what the hell wait did did I mess something up what is going on how, how is this possible what it was seven players right hello did I wait I'm not seeing Drew I'm not see... you know what I might do I might just override the picks then because what the hell happened I, I you literally saw them in the draft class I, I showed them in the draft he's right here did he not just get picked like what is going on but what's crazy is it's actually drew bill and um and and Jalen who just glitched out so is that gonna be like an issue or something but i'm not gonna lie i'm about to just give them to the teams and what's crazy is the grizzlies are about to have bill russell and yo, how, how, what happened wait hold on they're not in free agency dang what happened to your three-year deal trey murphy what the hell oh he might have got released that sucks sorry to hear that i am so confused Confused. can i at least before hold on you're gonna figure this out with me bill russell russell last name russell okay no yeah that the other russell hello d'angelo the other russell just disappeared you got the celtics one right here and then you got the nets one the original one so what i have to do is go to the grizzlies the nuggets and the bulls and i guess that's gonna be the new rule is screw it they, if 2k is gonna break the league then yeah sorry to the bucks and grizzlies if you wanted them but no nah, i guess they just didn't exist well actually no the grizzlies about to get one anyway so the grizzlies will get bill russell which is very redundant on their team they already have joel Embiid, but um yeah you got him buddy i don't know i mean you drafted damar who's a, a powerful when you already had carl malone so you already had issues nuggets get Jalen, which actually fits their team really well and the bulls get drew aside from that screw it i'm tired of this offseason let's get through this i would expect the celtics to still be favorites though if i had to guess like a wild guess yeah i'm assuming when like trying to load in players twice it glitches i even though you know what's crazy it's not even the same file like i'm actually i genuinely created new files for them too because i wanted them to be their more modern versions the quote-unquote modern or modern or whatever yeah but whatever screw it Jokic and bill walton i don't know i just looked at the players of the least all-stars but you know what that doesn't even matter for this because all the more do you have all their all-star appearances um screw it kareem 23 time all-star wilt wins mvp larry bird rookie of the year with the raptors bill russell six man scotty pippen dpoy cam whitmore trey young west until jr first team second team third team i oh, yeah, also trey young led the lead in scoring rebounds oh you know what forget rebounds yeah 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 okay you know what? no my equilibrium is thrown off right now let's go check the rebound 14 rebounds from kareem 14 assists from steve nash a bunch of steals from gary payton not surprising there field goal percentage will three point tobias harris all right now for the playoffs again we're gonna see like worldwide dominance from any of these teams yet okay well the celtics we know they've had a large impact on this wait the celtics the eight seed why were you the eight seed what is going on with you guys they got more talent on the bench as is but yeah drew donovan larry DeRozan, bill russell against bill walton chris stops dr j amen thompson and drew holiday oh they're back again and then mobley who i said was going to be a problem now he's a 97 um michael porter jr devin booker and oscar robertson against ewing cat mitchell and john stockton oh yeah they, they did i believe they drafted mitchell through that through the draft celtics win in six bill russell eastern finals mvp oscar western can't be too surprising the celtics made it here and so far they're breezing through yep boston is gonna sweep bill russell by the way the eight seed i still don't know why that happened they had 18 less wins than the wizards who they beat round one and the wizards are starting dylan brooks they are genuinely starting 84 overall dylan brooks so i actually deleted all of the files that i had and like all the ones for this video and then i re-downloaded the ones of the you know because i was doing that anyways so maybe that'll work for the draft class we'll see if not i'll just fix it again jordan goodwin retired top four grizzlies twice two Two picks that aren't their own the nuggets and the mavericks and it's going to go to the mavericks the sixers the warriors and hawks i guess also the grizzlies picks were protected because they are not here anymore and we you know it's funny i just saw the mavericks have their pick at 16. that's the only pick that was traded so they really got a complete whirlwind of emotions unless they knew it was lottery protected or something oh boy moment of truth is it going to be some random number one overall nope larry bird number one overall pick Don 
Donovan Mitchell goes number two. Number three, Cade Cunningham. Okay, so far, no Bill Russell. Uh, yeah, okay, so it just glitches him for some reason and whoever else. I think Drew, again. Yeah, whatever, I'll figure it out. Good lucky day, Bulls. So once again, if we had it, well, I mean, I could do a checkup technically. Actually, I could just go to the highest overall, overall players. So there go three Larry Birds right there. Two Wilts. Dang, wait, is Mellow a 99? Look at you. I see two Dr. J's right here, but honestly, I'm looking for Bill Russell. Yep, four Bill Russells. One of them technically got 24. That's the rookie one. So there goes three Cades as well, two Garlands, three Jalen Browns. Oh, wait, there's a fourth Jalen Brown. Yeah, I, I was thinking him and Drew are probably pretty duplicated in here. Yep, I just seen four Drews. I think they're all tied right now. The Bill Russells, the Drew Holidays, the Jalen Browns. I don't know. I mean, it's really the Legends League. So yeah, there's the All-Star teams. Magic Johnson wins MVP. Larry Bird, Rookie of the Year. Bill Russell, Sixth Man of the Year. Bill Russell, DPOI, the other one. Alexander Saar, Most Improved. James Worthy clutch player West has no junior coach of the year with the Spurs. First team, second team, third team. Worthy 30 points. Malone 14. Chris Paul 12. Chris Paul three steals as well. Three blocks for Bill Russell. You can see the other three Bill Russells also on the screen. Oh, wait, there goes the fourth one. Nets, Grizzlies, Rockets, Trailblazers, Sixers, Raptors, Nuggets, and Heat all eliminated. And yep conference finals bulls and bulls and celtics this is two bill russell teams against each other so it's looking like he has a big uh chance of dominance here honestly i'm kind of rooting for the well actually i think the bulls have a DeRozan as well as well right i believe they do let me check i, I kind of want him to uh no they don't no they don't they have drew the bulls have been eliminated by the celtics and the timberwolves out of here by the spurs we're gonna have larry versus magic in the finals in this tyler hero led team playing a chance to the celtics celtics dominance oh wow they won game one they are up two one three one three two okay oh not not some cast live and the spurs are gonna win the championship magic johnson is gonna put his hand in the ballot or whatever it's just magic johnson and james worthy and pascal siakam it's kind of interesting though i would have never expected honestly Honestly, I thought the Celtics were, gonna, were just going to win it every time. I saw them go back to the finals, and I'm like, you know what? Yeah, I've accepted this defeat uh, of my own creation. It's like people who made AI in 10 years. I think my favorite subsidiary of tweets is when people are tweeting out bad things about AI, and then someone just quote tweets it and says, David Stern. This is not Terry Stotts. That's not even him. He's an assistant coach now? Or did he just get hired back in this sim? I don't know. Draft lottery, Grizzlies, Knicks, Pacers, Thunder, and Wizards. Hornets, Wizards, Knicks, and Mavericks. Uh, the Pacers fell to six and the Hornets jumped up from God knows where the, the seventh pick. Okay. And the NBA draft, this shouldn't glitch because then these guys have ever been duplicated. First pick magic to the Hornets. Second pick James Worthy to the Wizards and third pick the Knicks. Ah, uh, they trade the pick for Lloyd marketing, but actually, you know what? It's Pascal. So that isn't much different, a little bit different, but you know, it, at least it's in the same realm. And it is interesting. They are obviously a little bit older now and yet the younger players still are like, but I mean, you'd obviously still take a 90 overall regardless. You're literally putting your team into better levels of contention immediately right i mean i don't know depends if it's like victor waiting to be picked here's the all-stars again magic johnson wins mvp magic johnson wins rookie of the year the other version of him and six man of the year the same one bill russell dpoy ace bailey most improved most malone Cl clutch player of the year chris finch coach of the year with the timberwolves screw the all nba teams 30 points 13 rebounds 13 assists by oscar robertson 70 percent from the field from bill russell 48 percent from three from shade and sharp flippers sweep the conference finals it's seven Seven versus eight seed over there. And by the way, Magic and them were the eight seed after winning the ring. Game seven in the East, between the Bulls and the Celtics, the two Bill Russell teams again. And the Bulls are going to advance. The Celtics are out of here. Magic and Dirk, conference MVPs. They got Bill versus Bill, Walton. Dirk and versus Paolo. Melo versus Wiggins. Beal versus Bain. And Curry versus Westbrook. This is actually a pretty good matchup. Screw it. It's 1 1. I'll start simulating. I feel like there's been enough gameplay in this video. I thought there was going to be more. I know that sounds stupid because I've been simulating through the games, but not many of the series have been close. Melo leads his Clippers to a win. Clippers, another win upcoming. And they're up 3-1. Up 3-2. There you go. Clippers, it looks like are going to hold on. And they're going to win the NBA championship. Bill Walton, finals MVP. Actually, another championship for Bill Walton. So Curry, Walton, Melo, Paolo, Chet, and Desmond Bain. Haywood Highsmith retired. Draft lottery. It's going to be the Pacers, Hawks, Lakers, and Kings. And the Sixers, Hawks, Thunder, and Kings get it. I don't know where the hell the Sixers came from. Oh, I just simulated through the draft. Anyways, the glitch happened with Bill Walton, so I got 
better place the Lakers do with him. Your lucky day. They also have Bryce James. Oh boy, someone can sign Denny Abdia. The Heat got him. There you go. All star teams again. Magic MVP. Melo rookie of the year. He got duplicated? He did, didn't he? Yeah, he did. Magic six man. Bill, wait, that's a different Magic, right? Okay, yeah. Bill Russell, DPOI, Taj Ariza, Carmelo, clutch player of the year on the Clippers. That Melo. Is this gonna. Oh, they got a young. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Yeah. I loaded this Melo into the draft and they made him have cornrows. It's the same exact. Maybe it's just a glitch. I don't know if it's premeditated, but it would make sense. That's kind of cool, actually, if that is, if that's, if that's true. First team, second team, third team, yada, yada, bada, bing. 30 points per game for Magic. Damn, 12 rebounds, 12 assists. Conference finals is going to be third versus fifth, Charlotte versus Celtics. Bill Russell versus Jared Allen, DeMar DeRozan versus Tim Duncan. Mother of God, I don't want to see anything else after that. Min Minnesota versus the Grizzlies. Jalen Brunson versus Allen Iverson. That's a cool matchup. Josh Christopher versus Clyde Drexler. Okay. Um, the big men matchup is very much in favor of the Grizzlies, though. And actually, they have Bill Russell on the bench. So, yeah. Hornets up 3-0. And that's a 4-0 sweep of the Celtics, which is kind of surprising. I mean, I know they had DeRozan on Tim Duncan. But, uh, yeah, talent-wise, it should have been in favor of the Celtics. But, hey, whatever. It doesn't really matter. It's cohesion. Basketball. You only have five players at the court at once. I mean, whatever. That's obvious. Um, and the team with Bill Russell and all them big men, Joel Embiid, lost to Brandon Clark at center. That is actually just criminal. And uh, Allen Iverson, Clyde Drexler in the finals. And that's 4-0. Tim Duncan finals MVP. The Hornets with second year Magic Johnson, Jared Allen, Paul George. They, they need this boost from this pick one Magic Johnson. They went from the worst team. So um, yeah, if you were to look over here, well, let's just go to centers real quick. Bill Russell, three, four times. You Larry Bird's out here. Honestly, if, that, if it's not obvious enough, um, I'm pretty bored. So I'm about to end the video. Hopefully you enjoy me numbing away your pain today. It's been real. It's been fun. My name is real fun. Shout out to Bob Cousy. Don't subscribe to the channel and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.